If Valentine's Day is the most romantic day of the year, then Galentine's Day has got to be the friendliest! I had an in-depth look online and can confirm. Galentine's Day is the best day to celebrate friendships! And there isn't anything more important than celebrating friendship with my two best gal pals! Even more important than celebrating the creation of the Paisley Prim? <gasps> Polly! You actually listened to my history of the pattern lecture? But yes, today is way more important. Now let's hurry up and swap these gifts. They aren't going to open themselves. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lila, your turn first. Shawnee and I have got you something, but it felt mean to wrap it up. We've hidden it in your favorite part of my room. These are almost better hiders than your friends! <gasps> oh my gosh! He's super cute! He's even softer than my cashmere scarf! You guys are the best! <laughs> and as well as being super cute, we thought he could act as your mannequin for your new business venture! Oh, what new business venture? Teddy T-shirts! Great idea! There's no excuse for an unstylish teddy bear! <laughs> <laughs> Shawnee's turn! Yes! We tried to wrap this one, but it wouldn't let us. We had to hide it somewhere that it couldn't escape. <laughs> yeah, and somewhere that we could keep on top of it. Hmm. Aha! A helium balloon? You guys remember that he is one of my top five elements from the periodic table? Well, of course! And we also knew that you needed a new science experiment. You can monitor how it deflates and write down the, uh, equations and things? I think we'll leave the science bit to the expert. Thanks, guys. That was so thoughtful. I'll make sure you're kept up to date with the findings. Ooh, I'll set up an alert now. Polly's turn! Close your eyes and put out your hands. <gasps> Pockets perfect candies! How did you guys find these? My grandma stopped making them ages ago. I haven't had these for years. We got in touch with her and she gave us the recipe. There was a surprising amount of science behind it, actually. Timing is most definitely the key. My decorating skills definitely got put to the test, but I can now add chocolatier to my resume. Ooh. Wait! I've just had the best idea! Tiny power! What's better than a piece of candy? A giant piece of candy! Pocket's perfect candies just got a bit more perfect! If I've done my calculations correctly, the balloon should contain enough helium to carry all three of us! Really? In that case, we'll need... a super soft landing pad! you for Galentine's Day. No, no more chocolate. chocolate! Hi everyone, Polly here, and welcome back to my vlog. Since discovering this map, it's all I can think about. I can't wait to explore all of these places. Want to join the adventure? Yes! <laughs> oh wait, let me turn on my camera. I need to record this for the vlog. Let's go then! Tiny power! Okay! 
Okay. Uh, how do we reach these destinations? Grandma's note mentioned scooters. Hmm, we need to get in the map first. Maybe there's a magic phrase that will let us in. Oh, <gasps> hey, what's this? <gasps> it looks like... A passport? <laughs> That's what Grandma Pocket meant by enjoy your passport adventures. This is what we need to explore the map. <sighs> but how do we use it? Hmm. If we go tiny by saying tiny power and holding on to the locket, what happens if we say tiny travel while holding on to the passport? <gasps> <gasps> Good idea, Polly. Tiny travel. <sighs> What if we say tiny travel while holding on to the passport and pointing to a place on the map? <gasps> Let's give it a try. Should we try the llama? <laughs> tiny <laughs> travel! We did it! We're in the map! We're at a music festival! Names, please? Um, Polly, Lila, and Shawnee. Oh, you're up next! Hurry, you're super late! Late for what? We just got here! Your names are on the Llama Rama talent show list to perform a dance! <gasps> what? what? How did we get on that list? Grandma! She must have signed us up! Well, as we llamas always say, the show must go on. Follow me. Huh? Uh, don't think I'm quite ready to perform in front of a crowd. We haven't rehearsed anything. It's okay. We can totally improvise this. There is one song that we know by heart. Uh... <laughs> it's okay. I'd have an idea. Tiny travel home. <laughs> we are stronger together. There is nothing we can do. All together we'll get through. And next up for Peanuts Pit Stop Karaoke Night, Wed Grande. <laughs> I changed my mind. Get the thing away from me, now! Looks like it's time for an encore. Yeah, baby, I love you. Pierce is sure enjoying himself. Someone has to. Yep, my brother's got that old pocket confidence. <laughs> Looks like Gwen could use a bit of it. She was way too scared to sing. Maybe we could help her build some confidence. You want to help Gwen? Gwen, Grizel's granddaughter. The locket stealer? Doing a good thing is still a good thing, even if the person we're doing it for is... Gwen? Besides, there's another reason to help. An ulterior motive? If we help her gain confidence, she'll be so busy doing fun stuff that she won't have time to even think about stealing the locket. Mm, okay, I'm in. I've been dying to get my hands on Gwen's wardrobe since kindergarten. Her wardrobe? I thought we were all about making her confident. When you look good, you feel good. Why do you think I always feel great? Well, we know one thing for sure. Gwen will never take our advice, which means we have to be sneaky. What could possibly be a bad idea about going tiny and sneaking into Grizel's pet house to redo Gwen's wardrobe? <laughs> The game almost over. We really need to study. One dozen, 
Okay, bye. One dozen. Yeah, okay, bye. Hey, Peanut, is everything okay? No. Last week, I created this recipe, the world's best cupcakes. Taste! Mmm. Mmm. Peanut, this is amazing. What's, What's amazing? Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So good. I know. Uh, but, Peanut, isn't this good news? Good! These cupcakes are so good, orders are through the roof. I can barely keep up. Your brother's been a big help on deliveries, but still, I haven't slept for days. Oh, again with the orders. Excuse me. Oh, just give it to me straight. How many dozen for tonight? Aw, oh, poor Peanut. Sleep signs would indicate he's entered the no snooze brain lose territory. Mm. Yeah, total bummer. Think we can get him to make us an extra dozen? Lila, Peanut doesn't need more orders. He needs our help. There. Now helping Peanut is officially on the to-do list. Another chance for me to make a difference. Peanut, we're going to... One dozen. Yep, okay, bye. According to the Journal of Getting Your Z's, a person Peanut's age will need at least six more hours shut-eye before he can really function. <sighs> Why is your phone still beeping? You've already done a million things today. Actually, helping Peanut put me behind on studying and knitting a blanket for Pax and helping my dad fix the sink. But it's okay, I'll get to it all. Now, ready, Lila? Ready. <laughs> And since we made them all pocket-sized to bake and frost all at once, all we have to do is... Go big! Cupcake! Go big! Cupcake! Ha! We did it! Uh... Shawnee? Uh, two dozen. Lila? Perfect. Will you power nap? I'll get my studying done. <laughs> 